January 2nd, 2006. A huge white light, and a few seconds later, it's like somebody set off a powder keg and shook the house, rattled the windows, and everything. An explosion at the Sago Mine in West Virginia kills one miner and traps a dozen underground. Eleven slowly succumb to carbon monoxide poisoning, but Randall McCloy Jr. is rescued after 41 hours. 1960. And we stand today on the edge of a new frontier, the frontier of the 1960s. John F. Kennedy says he's running for the White House. The Massachusetts senator narrowly defeats Vice President Richard Nixon that fall. 1942, just weeks after attacking Pearl Harbor, Japanese forces capture the Philippine capital of Manila during World War II. 1935, in New Jersey, Bruno Hauptmann goes on trial, accused of kidnapping and murdering the infant son of aviator Charles Lindbergh. Hauptmann is later convicted and dies in the electric chair, insisting to the end that he's innocent. And 1983... Jamal! The musical Annie, based on the Little Orphan Annie comic strip, closes on Broadway after 2,377 performances. Today in History, January 2nd, Camille Bohan and the Associated Press.